But we begin this afternoon with breaking news on the Upper East Side. A suspicious fire broke out inside the Sherry Netherland Hotel, and now investigators are looking into if it's linked to the arrest of an exiled Chinese businessman. And good afternoon, I'm David Navarro. I'm Sandra Bookman in today for Liz. Those flames broke out this afternoon while FBI agents were inside the $32 million apartment belonging to Go Wan Gui. The exiled Chinese billionaire with business ties to Steve Bannon was arrested and charged this morning in an ongoing investigation into fraud and money laundering. Now, the fire is now under control, but sources tell ABC News the apartment was significant significantly damaged by the flames. Eyewitness News reporter Joe Torres live on the Upper East Side with the breaking details. Joe. David, it's Andrew. Here's what you have. You have an afternoon fire inside a luxurious Manhattan hotel and residence, and that is preceded hours earlier by the morning arrest of a Chinese businessman that is, yes, accused of fraud and conspiracy. Both of those happening in the very same location. Now, at this hour, authorities have not connected the two officially, but there certainly are many unanswered questions. The two-alarm fire broke out shortly after noon on the 18th floor of the Sherry Netherland Hotel. More specifically, inside a 15-room penthouse, apparently owned by wealthy exiled Chinese businessman Guo Wenji. What started the fire remains unclear, and firefighters on the scene would not categorize it as suspicious. There were no injuries. But just six hours earlier, federal agents took Gu Wenji into custody at the luxury residence. It was those very same agents who later reported the fire and had to evacuate. The agents arrested the Chinese billionaire on fraud and money laundering charges following a lengthy investigation that accuses him of a $1 billion fraud conspiracy. The FBNY had the fire under control of 145. There was flame, not flame, smoke coming from the very, very top. You could see it from the backside. And then your fire department, which is incredible, blocked all of Madison Avenue. And then I don't know the next street up. Okay. They also blocked that street as well. You could smell, you could actually smell mm -hmm. that there was smoke. Right now, our fire marshals are on the scene investigating the cause and origin of this fire. And we'll probably be at this operation quite some time. It'll be an extended operation. And it has already been an extended operation. Traffic is absolutely snarled outside the Sherry Netherland Hotel, the plaza, all along Fifth Avenue as you head into Midtown. Fire marshals are still on the scene here. The chief, the fire chief, very cautious in his comments to reporters today, making a concerted effort not to reveal too, too much. As for the FBI, no comment from them as to whether they think the arrest and the fire are linked.